Uh, hi, I'm Jack Snyder reviewing Stephanie Vargas' speech, um, informative speech. Um, so, for the speech, um, you were wonderfully prepared. You had, uh, like, you were able to, like, distinctify, or distinct, or label the distinct groups of opioids, the heroin, the prescription, the Oxycontin, you're uh, super knowledgeable on all the different types of it. Um, you had a great speaking voice, you have a great presence when you're talking. It was really impressive how you were able to do it that clearly. And I think your ability to um, relate the story and have it come off as moving and deeply impactful while still being informative was really impressive. Um, as a minor critique, um, I do think you started sp speeding up a little bit um, as you went through your speech. Uh, you just got gradually faster. In the future, I'd try to slow down a little bit to maximize the clarity with the audience. I think that would be the best way about going about it. Um, other than that, I really didn't see that many issues with it. Um, you were really well rehearsed. Um, I don't think you looked at your script like once the entire time you were up there. That was really impressive. Um, uh, I also really liked your story that you had in the beginning um, about uh, the lacrosse player who uh, had no history with opioids and after being prescribed it, um, I believe it was once or twice after breaking like both of his collarbones around the same time, he got um, completely addicted and he lost his scholarships and just kind of go, that was impactful more so than anything else I'd heard in class yet. Um, the way you were able to relate that to us as college students in the same age group situation, um, that really hit home for a lot of people, including myself. Uh, all around, I think you did a really good job with your speech. You were super well prepared, and um, honestly, overall, I'd say um, you were super concise. Um, the way you said words, um, it felt uh, very rehearsed, but it didn't feel scripted whatsoever. Um, I might have already said it, but... Um, the way you were reading was almost completely natural. I couldn't tell the difference between you um, reading off the script and reading. It didn't seem in any way that you were just copying over. It was really impressive. I, I'm going to try to model the way I do my speeches from now on, kind of after that model. I'm, I need to work on it myself, but um, thank you.